It's time for change. Nadszedł czas zmiany. Przejścia do prawdziwego działania wszechświata. I nadszedł czas, aby zrozumieć, że używamy stanu materii, by osiągnąć poziom zrozumienia duszy człowieka. Teraz rozumiesz, być może, dlaczego Kreator wysłał swoich posłańców w imię tego, co miałeś. To oni przynoszą uszy, aby można było ich użyć, gdy nadejdzie czas Mesjasza. Mogę nauczyć duszę i przesłanie. Nie by się przeciwstawiać, ale poprzez ich zrozumienie przez tych, którzy stali się Mesjaszami, aby dawać ze swoich dusz, aby ich elewować. Zadanie stało się łatwe. Szkoła jest tutaj i uczniowie są tutaj w oddaniu. Wtedy nie będzie żadnej walki między tym, co nazywają muzułmanami a chrześcijanami. Baranek i lew będą jeść i spać w tym samym gnieździe. Chrześcijanie i muzułmanie będą spać i modlić się w meczecie, w tym samym kościele, w imię ich dusz, nie w imię religii, które są używane do tworzenia tak wielu konfliktów dla korzyści tych, którzy byli hiperaktywnymi dziećmi. Nadszedł czas, czas zmian jest tutaj. I jak powiedziałem, moje życzenie jest moim rozkazem. Jeśli pragniesz ujrzeć pokój, droga pokoju jest wyłożona bardzo wyraźnie. To dusza świadomości zbiorowej. Poprzez dawanie stworzy tą pozycję zmiany. Nic innego. W duszy człowieka nie ma długopisu. Jestem pewien, że po wejściu do społeczności uniwersalnej nigdy nie zobaczysz niczego zapisanego, ale równowagę pól duszy egzystencji. Staraj się być na tyle pokornym, aby nie stać się aroganckim w mocy, którą zrozumiałeś i posiadłeś. Inaczej wpadniesz w tą samą ścieżkę kościoła i meczetu. To jest to, co obiecaliśmy i to właśnie dostarczyliśmy. Musimy zrozumieć działanie duszy i musimy zrozumieć, że dusza człowieka jest gwiazdą w kosmosie Wszechświata. Jeśli porównamy duszę człowieka i tak wielu nas, 7 miliardów w jednym zbiorze, Ziemia jest jak galaktyka z tak wieloma gwiazdami. Kiedy patrzymy w głąb Wszechświata, widzimy galaktyki z setkami milionów gwiazd. Podobnie jest z planetą Ziemią. Niesie 7 miliardów pięknych gwiazd, które są duszą człowieka. Niesie z sobą duszę tak wielu trylionów zwierząt, roślin i wszystkiego innego. Jeśli więc patrzą ci, którzy nie widzą fizyczności Ziemi, i jej zawartości, co widzą? Widzą galaktykę z wielką ilością pięknych, świecących świateł. Każda według swojej siły. Każda zgodnie ze swoją pozycją. Niemowlę ma piękną duszę, podobnie jak staruszek. Dla tych niefizycznych, którzy nie widzą fizycznego wymiaru tej planety, ale widzą siłę pola, jesteśmy gromadami gwiazd. Ludzka rasa, każda pojedyncza dusza, nikt z daleka nie widzi. To jest dusza rybaka, to jest dusza kosmologa, to jest dusza prezydenta. 
Wszystkie świecą bez względu na fizyczność. To jest magia. Oto co nowa nauka musi przynieść człowiekowi. Kiedy patrzymy przez naszą duszę, widzimy tylko gwiazdy w innych duszach. I to jest przełom. To jest zrozumienie. Na tym właśnie polegają te wszystkie nauki. Dojście do dojrzałości następnego poziomu, aby zrozumieć daleki kosmos. Wszechświat jest ostrygą dla tych dusz, które służą. Wtedy człowiek jest gotowy do wejścia w kosmos. Wtedy człowiek jest gotowy, aby stać się częścią uniwersalnej społeczności, która została obiecana. Nigdy nie obiecywałem wam nieba. Zawsze obiecywałem wam elewację człowieka, aby przyłączył się do rodziny. A teraz macie klucz. To wy musicie otworzyć drzwi, aby zrozumieć, że mogę elewować duszę tych ludzi lub milionów innych dusz, że fizyczne życie na tej planecie zmieni się. Wtedy jestem godny bycia częścią społeczności uniwersalnej, by być, aby służyć, aby się rozwijać, by być tam, aby być częścią, że w cyklu życia wszechświata staje się w byciu częścią, staje się częścią totalności. Kiedy człowiek osiągnie ten punkt, pojawi się nowy wymiar w sile duszy człowieka, który jest poza wyobrażeniem zrozumienia życia fizycznego. To jest brama do otwarcia nowego życia w nowym wymiarze, co jest poza wyobrażeniem tego, co mogliście nazwać nowym początkiem, nowym cyklem, gdzie ten cykl niesie ze sobą źródło stworzenia życia we wszechświecie i unikosie. To jest elewacja duszy, aby służyć. Stała się kluczem. Nie trąż życia fizycznego. Czas jest odpowiedni, nadszedł czas, aby człowiek przeszedł przez ten proces. Witam na kolejnym warsztacie Instytutu Kosmicznego Fundacji Kesze. Są to 305 warsztaty poszukiwaczy wiedzy w języku polskim. Dzisiaj mamy niedzielę, 27 październik 2019 rok i tematem jest 298 warsztat. I czas przetłumaczony tego warsztatu to jest od 7 minut do godziny 53 minut. Tak więc zapraszam do wysłuchania i obejrzenia, a potem podzielimy się swoim zrozumieniem lub dodamy coś od siebie, może komuś coś jakby się ułoży i da nam jakieś rozwiązanie, co by można było zmienić w tej technologii, żeby się rozwijała w naszym kraju również. Tak więc zapraszam i miłego oglądania. Good morning, good day to you as usual, wherever and uh, whenever you listen to these series of knowledge seekers. Uh, yes, it's been dynamic last week and 
the week before, and last week, what we show has brought a lot of attention to many, many places, and many scientific world. We have had many responses, and as the Keshe Foundation, people can tell you in the background, since we shown the technology in the background in the Vienna conference, as the, the representative of the diplomatic corps present, this is the reason we set these conferences up for the governments to get to know the Keshe Foundation and the technology and what brings them. We have now, as you know, a uh, member of the Iranian government, uh, diplomatic corps were present in the meeting and we are invited to invest back to Iran in a larger scale with the support of the government for the technology. The advantages will be given is much more what we call beneficial to the work of the Keshe Foundation worldwide, as I explained to the, on the invitation of the government, uh, when I met the officials in the embassy last week, when they returned us back in, we are setting, we are looking at transferring some of, or most of the part of the production to Iran, and the medical side and agricultural side, as we have a, uh, we start this pattern of work. And at the same time, as I inform both Americans and the Iranian authorities, we use our technology as tool for peace. What this means, we have informed the American government and the Iranians to join us in Arizona, in development of the new space technology, and, same time, inviting both scientists on the space level to start interacting. And some eyebrows have been raised. And as you know, our team in Arizona is working towards finding and developing the first factory, which is an industrial, what we call, park for the new technology, and I'm sure soon you will see many Iranian scientists hand in hand with Americans in this center developing the space technology. <coughs> We've seen some videos in past few days shown new insight into the, what we call the space technology available to uh, Iran, and with this technology we share again with Americans. In the process of my discussions with both nations, it's very simple. We do not care what they talk in front. We care that we take man to space safely and freely. I thank both and the Iranian, what we call officials, for their, what they call invitation, and uh, their counterpart in American administration, which our proposal at the moment sits in the White House, waiting for the final decision by His Excellency President Trump to give the green light that the both sides can start the, what we call the sharing of the space technology together. Um, as I said, I don't work on the bottom level, I always work on the highest level in the government. And this has given me a lot of advantages to be able to reach both sides and any other government. <laughs> At the same time, the Keshe Foundation Global Team is following the other diplomats who attended. And as you know, in about two weeks' time, we are in Brazil for the second conference in this row. And the invitation for the ambassadors and the diplomats and politicians has started going out, and um, we will see again, we look at the same thing, we don't want more than 50 people in the whole conference. Um, not more than 20, 30 members of the Keshe Foundation is good enough for us, because it's for governments to engage, and we will, uh, in Brazilian conference, sign the first MOU 
with the government. One of the governments, world governments, will sign, you know, the papers will be ready, will be signed in the conference, and a few months later we'll change this one in their country, in our second conference, or in our next conferences, into agreement and the start of the Industrial Revolution in that country. The process is the only way it can be done. Technology like this has to be handled by the governments. As you are aware, um, we showed the very rough videos last week because we wanted to be out, because we had to fulfill some of the parameters which falls within our, what we call American Administration Cash Foundation Global, and we had to fulfill part of that. And then at the same time, we released new data, which means we shown a person and number of people who are using this process, how it's progressing. What we've done, we have brought the two videos together. You will see it in a much up-to-date. One thing which you will understand when you look at the gentleman in the background, you've seen it in a different way last time, is that medical report today from the hospital, you have to understand he's been on this process just over about six weeks, um, is that his medication has been reduced by 57%. Which means not only you will see the gentleman recovering to his position, his medication which has been given to him for his case of uh, Parkinson's Alzheimer's has been reduced by 57%. We have other cases which are parallel with this research in the same group. And in there, we have a patient which is taking 47 tablets a day. That's a young boy, age of 19, taking 47 tablets, medication. And uh, this we have seen now reduced by around 17% in the first three weeks. And by the end of the fifth week, we expect him to reduce by 50%. You got to understand the new technology which we have developed gives mankind a new chance. No side effects, no problems with what we've seen. Not our youngsters to be pumped in with medication in the level of 50 tablets a day. And it's been going on for nearly three years, what we see from his records. This is the third year of it. And you can understand how this new technology will change. We're planning to show the system some around, just before Christmas, as a Christmas present, in one of the medical centers which is getting set up in Europe. It is very important for the knowledge seekers to understand the system has already received orders and we have received deposits on large scale operation initial moving forward we are planning for. So we have come into a commercialization of the new technology with understanding that people like a young boy of 19 taking 47 tablets a day. I wonder how many of you can take that a day. If you multiply it by pure, purely by 365 days, you can see how much tablet this, this little boy has taken. He's back to college. He now works. He's back to studies. He starts doing homework. He starts communicating. He's not, he doesn't have the fear of going on the street. All the things with his life in three weeks has changed. You got to realize that we video every step of the development. What we say, we deliver. 
today's video has been set in a way that you will see it and there is a lot of questions comes around to us from different part of the world i have received many requests cash foundation channels receive different requests the request is we would like to be part of it we don't have the money to buy it we have a little what we have decided is the following we're separating this in two three different sections that you will understand let us watch the video first the new release and then we explain the chinese system development certification then we do the european uh, and the americans and south americans and africans how we are going to set up with your as people as a group that you become part of the work of the cash foundation and at the same time you benefit by the work and the investment which you want to do for your loved ones that you can help the others rick would you like to play the system the video please innovative revolutionary stellar development purest universal knowledge in a transformative futuristic design stick to the universal body enhancement spaceship unit the very first new evolutionary spaceship technology has been rolled out for mass production our universal body enhancement spaceship unit is constructed from high quality materials carefully selected by our team of experts. Embedding the essence of the new GANS plasma science and technology, it uses collective plasma field technology for changing and enhancing the environment of the body of the man. This new plasma enhancement changes the environment of the body to allow it to return to its natural balanced energetic condition as in the womb of the mother, allowing every cell in the body of the man to find its natural original field strength balance. The shape and field distribution in this new space plasma technology replicates the inner structure of the universe and replicates the balance fields from which the man was created at the point of inception in the womb of the mother not only receiving balance in the physical, but also in the emotional sense too. For the first time in the history of man, a system has been developed and delivered, which not only enhances the physical body of the man, but also enhances the emotional part of the user of the system. Hence reducing and eliminating many problems that could not be solved in the world of science. To bring the body of the man into near perfection as at the time of birth. This new spaceship technology can be within the reach of every man today and can be ordered by medical practitioners, sports specialists and healthcare centers. The Universal Enhancement Spaceship Unit, the future you have been waiting for, is here. The journey from space to spaceship technology has started. Every order is subject to a contractual agreement and might require additional accessories priced separately for applications according to each case. You can order or contact us at office at at.kfm. Dot global for additional information.
Thank you very much. As you have seen, <coughs> this gentleman, like many other Parkinson and Alzheimer cases, it will be another 10 years, maybe in a wheelchair, in bed, numerous amount of <coughs> medication, and not only touches his life, but it touches the life of people around him. Can you put the picture of the machine on, please? Um, and in this process, it literally imprisons the whole family. Plus all the pain and the suffering which brings on the family and themselves. In more or less eight weeks, half an hour a day, using this technology which is in front of you, which literally comes less than 30 hours, all together. You change the life of a man for good, and the families. This is the power of the new technology. This is what is delivering, and this is what is set to deliver, in a very, effective and a fast way. Not only we see changes in these people in the physical dimension, we see the change in emotion, we see change in attitude. And we see the same thing, the life, the hope, the family, all changes and for the people who've been around this process for long enough, they know what it means. Instead of planning how to bring the children up, 
without parents, how bringing up parents with other children all comes to an end. It does not mean because of this technology we all gonna survive till the end of the life of this universe. But it means the time we are in the physical dimension we can live a more peaceful life with less problems, with less diseases which some we have created ourselves, some created by the condition of the life and environment. Mankind has moved into a new dimension and is unchangeable. It cannot be changed. With it will bring a lot of new technologies. This is the first small step in this direction. This is not the end, this is not everything. These machines will be manufactured and delivered through the process of collaboration of the Keshe Foundation supporters around the world, as we have seen. We have received the initial orders from the knowledge seekers or doctors and or they are there to set up the first step. What we see is a lot of requests by many Cash Foundation supporters like we have a small amount of money, we have a sick father or sick mother or ourselves and we cannot afford this. We all can afford this. You pay you 20,000, 10,000, whatever, we set up a company, jointly owned by those who invest in it, and these machines become the investment. Not only we allow the people who invest in it themselves, or maybe one member of the family, to use it on the, what we call, um, the usage of what they paid for, then, as it gathers and creates condition for other people around the world to use it, as they pay for it, then this becomes an income. As the shareholders of the company, which the machine and the technology belongs to, you become, you create a revenue for yourself. Cash Foundation takes the 30% and that becomes our revenue, because we still have to support the background support and everything else. Then, in a way, it's a perfect investment for those who live with the ethos of the Foundation. Doesn't matter in which country you are, we can put collective number of people together in different part of the world, and you can fly into it, or you can make it in your own city, five or ten people together, a small amount, can pay for the system. Then, these become cash foundation, what we call health centers. There has to be a doctor, physiotherapist, and a nurse, which can look after it. At the same time, as you will see from beginning of December, we will give, address and announce the systems which is placed around the world that you can, if you want to fly to, or you say we want in this area to have. We have a information for our Chinese knowledge seekers. Some of you have reached us that you want to have the system or you want to be able to use it or how you can support it. This system in China is going to go through its clinical trial for certification of the Chinese system. The way which is done on the principle and the work in China Knowledge seekers collectively can buy one system, as I explained, and we make it available to the research centers. Once the research completed, which is less than three to six months, 
then these machines will return or stay where it is and the revenue from their income for the people who use it becomes your revenue. Everything will set up legally in the framework of companies system by system and many Chinese followers of the Keshe Foundation want to do it, they want to put part in it. Please contact Cash. As we announced last week, the email, and you will find out you can contact them and we'll set it up very rapidly. This research on Chinese side will start somewhere first weeks of November. So we need about 30 machines in China to go through the uh, what we call clinical trials. Between you, 10,000, 5,000, whatever, whoever puts together, we said one company for valuation of one machine. And you have, as a team, you drive it, you run it, your team will run it. Or we have seen a number of Chinese millionaires have offered to buy the system for their own family private use, or they want to use it for a specific disease that one of the members of the family has. That can be organized. One of the first two things which we want to complete in China is Parkinson and autism. So, our Chinese followers go through the WeChat, get in touch with, you know, the officials of the Keshe Foundation in China, go through the email which we gave last week, which is with the Chinese community, say what you want to do with it, that we can put this structure for certification into the Chinese authorities through the legal frame which is available to the foundation work. We work with the team of scientists and officials and government structure that this process will go very fast. You got to realize we need 30 patients per case. So if we use half an hour per patient twice a day, maximum we can take eight person per machine. So we need four machines for let's say Parkinson to go through the trial with what is going through. We need four for autism. We need four for cancer. We need four for Alzheimer's. So what we ask the generous community of the Keshe Foundation in China, contact us and put together this that collectively the Chinese community will benefit by it and it will be publicly done. The trials will be very much in public domain and you can follow it. Go exactly to the email which was issued last week and from that email we will respond accordingly as we have. A number of people have contacted through the Chinese line to the Cash Foundation for help or they want to invest. Please, it's no problem if you use the link which is given or go to the sales section of the Cash Foundation for the system and send a message to us. We have received a request from Macedonia. Our friends in Macedonia, you have to structure it the way we said. We have requests from United States, we have requests from Mexico, we have requests from number of European countries who they know me, they have contacted, they want to do. We have requests from Middle East. The state of 
Emirates will be handled differently totally by the foundation. I know many people who want to invest with the machine in Emirates. Let us handle the way we have it structured there. We'll come back to you and according to what we have and we'll, what we set up in the coming time. India is another point for us. We'll come back in and we will announce what it is. Do not, please, do not ask us to do something which is beyond the limitation of the Keshe Foundation, it's work. You can go to the Keshe Foundation Global in United States to send your inquiries and orders. You can go through the Keshe Foundation website or get in touch with our officials through the email which is given last week about Keshe uh, Plasma China at gmail.com or was it QQ? Can you send, can you post that up again please if you have it? Uh, yes, we'll get that up. I think it was at 163.com QQ, but Q.com, yes, that's the one. Okay, if you we'll can find that. it, yeah, please keep it on the screen and uh, keep it uh, on the Cash Foundation link with that the Chinese can reach it. We are, we know in China we can get this done very rapidly through structure with the support of the scientific world in China. They have shown us, we just got to find a way to do it, uh, that all the knowledge seekers in China are involved in it. And uh, at the same time, we want you to monitor. It's important that we give the link to every patient which is on the monitoring of the system you bought, that in the organization, you understand the technology, you grow up with it, you become agents of your own knowledge and technology. <clears throat> we can do the same in Europe and America or South Africa or in Africa or Asia. Number of knowledge seekers, we need to put together to be able to bring these systems into operation. The first machines will be delivered into United Kingdom on the CE regulation certification. The first machines will be two machines in Germany with partnership of the Keshe Foundation and one independent. One machine will go to New Zealand. Number of machines will go to South America and Western Europe. We can meet up to 100 systems a month from January on. So we can structure it from March onwards, more machines can be delivered. It has to be collective. If you are in a country, but you don't have access or you want to have the finances, but to be used for setting up a system somewhere else to be part of it, it can be done. We are one nation, one planet, one race. We have no borders. So if you live in Africa or you live in America, you want a machine to be bought, to be put in Africa, it can be done because still it's under the same structure. As <coughs> you remember last week, I explained to you these systems will become feeding stations. And this is a space technology and it's, it's limit where you can sit, go into the machine and receive the energies which become the energy you need for daily use as food, as energy to live. These machines on delivery by first generation maybe by the second generation, will be self-powered. 
which means they do not need any power supply. We can drop it anywhere and it will supply itself. To this effect, Keshe Foundation makes the following announcement. Keshe Foundation has brought the system of wireless technology energy transfer into operation. I have received the clearance in past few minutes to make the following announcement. Keshe Foundation will release self-charging systems in the coming days to company Huawei in China for their evaluation. This means from finishing of the agreement, once we come to agreement with Huawei, your mobile phones do not need charging. Charging phones has become the history of the past. At the same time, we deliver the technology to automotive industries from Monday of next week. Major automotive companies which are going to electrical, it means they do not need to worry about recharging and at the same time, they do not need any concern about fuel consumption. <coughs> I have spread this technology in two, three different countries that cannot be stopped. As I said, we have, have fully understood the implication of this technology and we will show the power of technology on the energy side to major corporations, automotive industry manufacturers, in the coming days. This will change a lot for Cash Foundation and the contract with these companies will be made public by the Cash Foundation. This is not a part of the Cash Foundation global operation. This is the Cash Foundation itself, is his own assets and his own technology. <coughs> so what this means uh, from next few months, you will see a huge evolution and revolution in the world of electronics. Delivery of energy from the energies of the space rather than resources of this planet. Following that, we will show the new technology for environmental cleanup of the water resources. We have had this for over three years in our book and now we will release this technology in the coming weeks to United States with the problems with one of the major corporations which was found $365 million penalty for creating cancer to clean up the waters. We will introduce this into the government of Italy for cleaning up of the waters and this technology has fully been tested will release the report done for the government of Italy for cleaning up of the waters of the nine most dangerous cancer agents which are in our system. <coughs> for this reason, you will understand, we'll bring many changes in. Our negotiation with governments is on an open basis. The Cash Foundation team working on the global or the Cash Foundation 
will work as one team to negotiate with all the nations on equal basis. We have no problem dealing with any government as long as our technology is used for peaceful application and understood that we will not stand any pressure. There is one proviso, the state of Belgium is red circled. Till our situation in European court is clarified for misconduct of Belgium officials in bringing armed officers in the courts in what we call destroying evidence, changing evidence and we give one alternative to the Belgium state. Arrest of the threat circle, as they offered we accept. Arrest of the police officer who is instigated by them and both cases has to have correct judgment for their sentences. We are prepared to open negotiation directly with the state of Belgium because the evidence of the European court is very clear. During the Hitler time, we have seen people disappearing in the courts, armed officers in the courts. We have seen the same in regime in Baghdad previously. Now we have seen on the evidence of witnesses in the courts of Belgium, which is against the law and is done by the police officers. We are prepared to negotiate directly with the state of Belgium for all the damages they've done and prison sentence for Red Circle and the officers who we have pictures present in court. We have no other demand except our damages covered. In the way we are responding to your offer, we accept to negotiate, but our terms is very clear. Very, very clear. The officials of the state of Belgium, they tell us, is done by a rogue officer, and a guy who has stolen many patents. Our response is very simple. We will demand prison sentence on tampering with evidence, destroying evidence, false accusations, and many other things which done by the officer. And the same with the red circle. Cleaning up of the websites internationally is the job of the Belgium security not us. In that process, the rest of the world has a free run of the technology. What we are structuring is the following. As we are finding many investors who want to invest, we need doctors, we need physiotherapists, and we need nurses who can work in these centers, getting set up, financed, to become the health centers, what we call, as his name says. So today, please, those of you who are doctors, nurses, and in what we call health, um, business, contact the Keshe Foundation, through the medical teaching side, we will train all the doctors and we open one channel for all the doctors who use this system. Please, go to, you can go to orders.us kfgl.global you can go to cash plasma China at 163.com or you can send your request directly to the foundation at our store site, Cash Foundation store and find the right link and send it to us, we respond. 
those of you who are there to support, to bring the change, this is one of hundreds of new technologies which we release in the coming months. This is the beginning. And you can see the revolution in it. This is the beginning in understanding the new technology has come in. With this comes the next step, energy, next step, environmental cleanup, next step, production of materials, next step, what we call agricultural through space development, then it comes, as I've informed the Iranian officials, on the 19, 20, 21st, 22nd of April 2020, in the beautiful city of Tehran. We will show the flight system. Those of you who had a dream to see UFOs in the hand of public, in the hand of people, in the hand of one nation, not governments, we will show it to you in Tehran. But the thing is, how can we show something flies when we cannot show what's in it and how it operates? That's why we start releasing the technology as the tradition with the Cash Foundation back to front. These are the machines. Once we open the space technology, you will see. This is the machine which you will be fed. You will come over the plasma fields of the universe which might touch you. You might have decided to take your dog with you and it gets a disease. You can go into the same machine. And at the same time, every material which we can produce in a replication of another system like this, which is, you have seen before, it will be done. In so many ways, I think the Keshe Foundation team have seen the video of the second system. The system which will be used to the, what we call, um, space for material production is a slightly different, but more or less the same. And is in so many ways a breakthrough for science. These systems will deliver to us everything that we need in space. In so many ways, we are ready to operate in an industrial what we call size production of mass production of materials and at the same time we are ready to do the same across this planet the the what we call the production system material is very much the same Rick, I have sent you a picture for the system production unit, which still has a chair in it too. Would you like to open it? Can you hear okay. me? Okay, yes, uh, thank you. Just give me a minute here. Yeah, you will see the, the industrial version, which is mainly for production of materials, is slightly similar, but in a way, it's set up differently because it needs different um, operation and apparatus. The breakthrough in technology will come this way, step by step. You see what is built, what is in, how it operates, how you have your energy system, how we collect energies from the cosmic fields and convert them to human use, AC and DC how will impact the use of energy on this planet to make it free, available at a point of need. 
Many of you who went with us with the generator, we will show you the MAGRAP system, which is a power generator. Now that we have released the off-grid, what we call energy supply for this machine, it allows us to release the MAGRAP systems. Not this one, not this one, there's another one. Not this one. There's two pieces with that one, there's a video. It allows us to release the power generator. No, not this one. There's another one, there were three pieces. It's a video. In so many ways, that's the one, yes. This, this, this unit will become the production of the materials because it will set that it can create the condition of the Earth in interaction with the fields of the Sun and in the center will create, produce as much material as you like. You can play it. And in the process we understand that the system has the same capabilities. This allows us to produce huge amount of material simultaneously. And in so many ways, you will see new technologies which emerge on this basis of this deep space technology, plasmatic field operation. You got to realize the change has come and I promised by 19 I will bring it and it's here. 2020 will be massive development, deployment of new technology across the world. We could not have done this without all of your support. We all done our bet, good, bad, we thought it's good, it turned out to be bad, we thought it was bad, it's turned out good. This is the beauty of a big family. That we can collectively work and bring it together and delivering such a beautiful technology. When I see the video of the 19 year old boy with 47 tablets a day, when he walked into the hospital, when I saw him with his mother, with the doctors, to see what system we need to produce for him as the doctors take over the medical application of it. I thought, I have children young, same, younger than him. What's the future? How much more medicine we can pump into these people? With no results, and the more and more and more and more and more, because once they get into cycle 47, the side effects becomes worse, and they have to give more for side effects. But I've seen this before. Now, we will release the same video as you've seen with the first gentleman of the young boy back to school, working behind computer, being able to live, being able to communicate, parents being able to enjoy their childhood. One of my biggest dream was to be able to change a life not at the end, but at the beginning. And for the first time, this system allows us to, with our children. We look at these systems, if you got a Parkinson, you have another 10, 20, 10, 15 years left of living, even we help you another 30 years, 40 years of comfortable life. But the child with autism, the child with any kind of problems at early age has a lifetime of suffering. With this technology, we can bring the change. With this technology, as it's not intrusive, it's by working the same as the way we were born in the womb of the mother, this is the beauty of this technology. 
many of you have asked us, can it change DNA? Can it change RNA? Can it change interfere uh, that damage is done by changes in DNA can be reprocessed? My answer is very simple, but you have to understand this is the long-term delivery. Long-term for me is 12 to 18 months, not in 20, 30 years. The answer is yes. This technology has a full capability to reset the DNA for any defects. I will explain this to the scientists in the due course, how they have to do it. And using this technology, unless the damage is so severe physically that it cannot be done, most of those who are on the mental level, it can be helped. When you see a child suffering so talented with this kind of diseases, to me is a life sentence of imprisonment. And with this technology we can change it. We, as you will see the first units come out, the interest and the results will bring the world of science to us. Many people tell me you're not afraid of pharmaceuticals, you're not afraid of big financiers. No, because there is no pharmaceutical in the space and there is no finances in the space. We are not working for, to change, we are here to test, to open the space for humanity. All the pharmaceuticals welcome to come and bring the knowledge into dimensions of understanding. All the agricultural material medicine we use for centuries now can be transferred. These systems will have a heartbeat of a human being. Those of you who are in Vienna, you have seen it. Now we are getting the testimonials coming in from the people who have been in the system in Vienna. It's very, very strange. I received two of them last night or earlier to hours of this morning. When you read it, what they have written, is amazing. I, we can, we can, I can read some of it for you, but two people more who have been in, it says conclusion, after only a single 30 minute session, until today, no more neck pain. Pain right shoulder and right upper arms have become easier. Positive emotion expressed. They just sat in the machine, they wanted to be in it for a few minutes. He says, thank you very much for giving us this possibility to what we call the Keshe Foundation work. My biggest target is to be able to change the life of the children and being able to give them a peaceful life. And we will see this technology will bring it with deliberate. There is no nation on this world which will stop this technology. The reason for it is that the world leaders suffer from the same pains themselves and their families as the rest of us. We see that the German group who have already placed order for these units have already offered this technology to the Chancellor of Germany for help. We stand by and support them. In the coming weeks, you will see addresses of the places where you can go in Europe 
And you have to understand, in most of these, we support, and in a way, we try to understand more of how to use, to elevate and to alleviate the pain of the people. We put there, at the price of 150,000, as you see, is this is still November, I'm oh, sorry, 1st of January. From 1st of January to 1st of March, it goes to 500,000. And from 1st of March, the price will be set at 1 million euro. The, the structure is very simple. We have one point, those of you who carry pacemakers, stents, you carry parts which is uh, addition to your stomach, those of you who have a ring in stomach for reduction of the stomach, you cannot use this technology. The energy transfer creates what we call attachment of the material to the flesh and can be dangerous. So, you have to understand there, at this moment of time, we have this limitation. And I don't see any other way to do it. There is a way to do it, which is using the chair, which you see, in coming time to remove these materials from the body and at the same time replace and create a condition of repair. But this is at least two years away. It's not something you'll be done tomorrow. I wish I could do it today to help one of my best friends. It can help it. With this technology, we have to work together to deliver in every city, every country. And understand, we don't take the wealth with us, but we can carry the blessing of the people who we help. We might think we are healthy today, and tomorrow it can change. Don't think I'm paying for a system when I need it. Help the others who suffer now, that we can bring this technology fast, that with their blessing, you might not ever need it. The operation is very simple. This is the beginning of new industrial revolution. And it has to come with it. The understanding of the man that there is no need for creating tools of war and everything else. The interesting part is, if you could get access to 10% of the American 930 billion dollar budget, military expenditure, more or less, which is 93 billion, every major city would have a factory, industrial zone, and many industries which will use this technology. We have chosen the path of killing than the path of living. And with this technology, those who go into it will change the state of their emotion and mind to elevate it. One of the biggest gifts of this technology will come where the mankind become wise. As you know, one of the most greediest men in the world of technology, Edison, trying to prove one of the most beautiful scientists of our time, Tesla to be wrong, 
by developing the AC, he created the electric chair to prove that this can kill. He put an elephant through electric shock, put them in the machine, he made the machine to kill and it's used for execution in the United States. As um, the path of following structure of the Tesla, using the technology for benefit of mankind, we will not see prisoners. As by use of this technology, we can elevate the soul, the understanding of the man, that we do not need to imprison the man in the cage, in his brain and in a room. But by Putting him in this machine, we elevate his souls, that we don't need no more prisons. Very soon, we'll offer these to correctional centers in the United States and across the world, as an alternative to imprisonment. Now you understand how urgent it is for us, to bring the change. Those of you who have spent time in prisons for different reasons or know, and we see every day more and more black people are committed to prison in the United States, and we see more and more people because of the addiction, trying to supply the daily need to satisfy the addiction, which is more or less now half of the prisons around the world, with well, this technology do not need to be there. The change is huge. When we can take a boy of 19 from 47 most effective addictable drugs to control mind. You can see there's not much problem addiction with this. As I said, we'll change the history of man through this technology and step by step we will open the door. In releasing the new wireless technology and power from the universal energy, we freely clean the environment. The beauty with this is, today with cars which are battery operated, we pay 160,000, 180,000 dollars for a car, and the car worth about 60, the other 100,000 is for free supply for the rest of the life of the car for 25 or 30 years. But the energy is burned somewhere else, as I said before. But the biggest crime, criminality with it is, each of these cars carry 6,000 batteries. As we heard recently, one of the major corporations in car said that the old batteries used to do 385,000 miles and the new batteries in their cars from 2020 will do 1 million miles before it drops by 10% and then it needs to be scrapped. Can you close the microphone please? There is a microphone open in the background. Rick. Thank you very much. But the beauty with this technology is, these cars, when they're finished, we have 6,000 highly dangerous chemicals, batteries, now we have to dispose of. Nobody's talking about that part. And now, when you sell a million, you have 6 billion batteries. If we sell 10 million, we have 60 billion batteries a year to bury in 20 years time. 
with this new technology, there is no battery, the way we know it. To be able to deliver the technology, we have developed a new battery, which will come into operation at the same time. This has no chemicals, has no residue. It's a solid state, and with it, will safe guarantee the operation of new technology. New energy system needs new way of delivering it. So, in the coming time, you will see new batteries, new generation of batteries which is already developed to come into operation, especially like with this system. This will change a lot of things for us, at the same time. <laughs> One of the advantages with this system is the application of it in deep space. In deep space, anyone get attacked or attached with a high magnetic field, what we call the virus, by putting them in this machine, within seconds we can bring balance. If you understood this, you will understand simply, if we replicate the same thing, it does not take much to understand what happened when we put war leaders and the soldiers through this machine. Would we have war leaders? Now, would we have soldiers? Don't forget, every man gets sick. Be the soldier, to the president, to the king. But the beauty of is, the beggar on the street, and the king on the street, will sit on the same chair as their throne as they try to save their lives. That is why all men are equal. I go especially to our Chinese group. Some of you have asked, I want to buy a system for my family. Understand, your family is the rest of human race. You are not born on your own in that place and have that child. Work with us to deliver this technology rapidly. Work with us as a non-profit organization. We invest everything back into the helping the people. I had a request from one of the knowledge seekers. The money I paid for such a thing to be delivered from Italy, can that be part of the deposit for the machine that is bought and I'll be a shareholder? The answer is yes. Those of you who want to convert your orders, by closing Italy, we can do go to one way or the other, and this can be done too. Invest in the society, and the society invest in your freedom. Any questions? Okay, thank you, Mr. Kesh. Uh, there is one of our attendees with a hand up here that uh, uh, Baba I I 
Yanni. Allow them to talk and they can ask their question. Hello, do you want to go ahead? Do you have a question about the uh, about which, what Mr. Kesha has been discussing? Hello, Baba, can you open your microphone? Okay, they might be having some trouble with the microphone. Perhaps they didn't intend to put their hand up. In any case, I'll remind the attendees they can put their hand up in order to ask a question, and the panelists can uh, go ahead if they like. And let me see, you've already answered uh, Bente's question regarding the, uh, she had a question regarding the DNA. Um, more specifically, it was about the things such as poisons, which are known to change the DNA and, and uh, GMOs and so on. Can that be reversed back, the uh, damages that are done by such uh, dioxin or, or even nuclear radiation? Um, yes. Uh, this can be all discussed and can be done. And uh, it's, uh, we consider radiation as part of the cosmic rays. And uh, there should be no problem with that. I know there is a request. Um, you had a question, is there another question? Uh, Mr. Kesh, on the Spanish side, they're asking if uh, the second generation of these machines have an independent power supply. I think this has been already cleared, hasn't it? Uh, yes, we tried to do that in the first generation. Uh, Mr. Kesh, there was a question on uh, radioactivity in uh, Tokyo. Is that part of uh, what you would like to address right now, or yes, that go, ahead. go ahead. Okay, we had a question from uh, Miyahiko. Not sure if I pronounced that right, and uh, who says uh, I live in uh, Tokyo, Japan, and on the twenty sixth of September, in the train of the Sobu line. I detected with my Geiger counter, um, I think it's nine, it's a strange symbol, I don't know what it is, nine uh, something per hour of radioactivity after stopping in the Nakano station. So I got off the train at the next station. There the radioactivity was normal. Generally the radioactivity is about 0.1 in this area in Tokyo. So this is 90 times higher. I thought someone was illegally transporting a kind of radioactive material, or maybe I was hit by something like a radioactive laser gun or something like that. I read Wikipedia and it was written that there were, that there um, is an X-ray laser Quote, shooting electrons on a plate of metal can make an X-ray, but it makes a lot of heat, unquote. So there is a problem of heating of that weapon. But if someone has the cash technology, there is the technology of superconductivity and so on and can solve the problem of heating. Sorry, I'm not a scientist, I'm not sure. So I hope if I got your opinion, if this high radioactivity was created by any sort of weapon or not. Thank you so much. Mia Hiko. Yeah, thank you very much. Um, we know in China the radiation has traveled the whole nation. You got to understand a lot of people traveling 
Japan from radioactive areas, they live or they work or they travel, they sit on the trains, they travel, they carry things with themselves, unknowingly contaminated. The process is, even if it's produced um, by laser, or what they call monoenergetic systems, um, these all can be, can be changed, and they can be absorbed, and they can be made harmless. The position with Japan is very critical, because um, by not releasing the data and the facts, uh, Japanese government has managed to, uh, what you call, um, stop the talk about and what, how further the contamination has moved around. What is localized contamination in Fukushima and the reactors? They brought it under control, but you got to understand it blew up the whole country more or less. It's a spread. There are pieces of it, there are part of it which are there. People carry, they buy goods, they bought vegetables. It still goes on. The Fukushima situation, will not resolve for next 200 years from Japan. Because every gram of the material which blown up in the reactors are not accounted for. We don't even know where they are. As you know, we've done a lot of work with TEPCO, we've done a lot of work with, if you remember Yokoko going back to Japan, showing that it can be done. And uh, in so many ways, um, these kind of radiations are become normal part of our lives in a space. We will mutate to accept or to be able to absorb part of it. Many races in the space have done so because it needs a different kind of breathing, different kind of energy transfer. It's very much like when we go to a high altitude and low altitude stills on the Earth, we have different, we go under the sea, we have different application. And so, we will see these X-rays and gamma rays will be a child playing compared to the rays and the middle of plasmatic fields in the universe. There is not much worries to have if you receive one instantaneous or uh, what they call it, few milliseconds of exposure, but um, to carry these small handheld lasers is something that um, you have to see the capability and possibility of the usage of it and how they've developed it. But in general, should be no worries. And uh, the beauty of the next generation of the communication, which will come with the plasma technology, uh, this is something which we will open up into public in the coming time, will not have the same effect as what the telephone masks have nowadays. The new communication system, plasma communication system, is totally different than the present communication systems we have. As I said, well, we, we will, as we deliver the a new, what we call, um, self-sustained energy absorption from the plasma of the universe, mobile phones and your laptops and um, your, as I was asked yesterday, your mixers or your drill machine, uh, you will find out that this will change everything. You got to realize what we tell you now, like mobile phones which can power themselves, the drilling machine. Just go back to the original pattern, it's in the pattern. Now we are opening it up. It's not something new, which we are telling we're going to do. The technology has been with us 10 years ago, 15 years ago when we wrote the patterns. 
So now when we speak about this, even this, uh, what we call the enhancement unit, going to the patent, we are delivering the technology of the patent because you as knowledge seekers did not manage to do so. It's been with you for four years, five years. It's been open pattern, you cried for it, why don't you give it? We opened it, you read it, you couldn't understand, you put it aside. So, what we are delivering now is a step by step what is in the pattern. The existence of the room to go in, to receive, to heal, is in pattern. Please, any of you who have access to it, you downloaded it, just bring the number which section. What we tell you now is actually bringing every section of the pattern open for public. Is not something new. Patents were submitted 2005, 14 years ago. Technology was delivered in Iran 2009, sorry, uh, space was already 2008, the beginning of it, 1960s, 1970s. This is not a technology which just suddenly popped up. It's a technology which is put in step by step, developed, open the pattern. Those of you who have access, bring it out, tell, us, tell the rest what it says in the pattern regarding the environment you go in and you see it, or your illnesses and the rest of it. So, to you, Keshe Foundation has brought the enhancement Cash Foundation, released this pattern, 2005, with this technology in it. 15 years, nobody has done anything. Now we're delivering, in a way, we are delivering what's in the patent to those of you who could not read the patents. The delivery of the promise. In so many ways, the patterns we release is the promise of the delivery of a new technology. Very much is a new Bible of science. And now you see what has been there, now it's getting delivered. You should not be, oh, they come up with something new. No, we are delivering what we showed in the pattern. You couldn't do, we are doing it for you. The battery system, if you look at the patterns, it shows you a drill with the unit in it. So now you understand, you say they don't have it. We say, very simple, the world was not ready for it. Now we are pushing the human race to work with it. So, those of you who've been telling, oh, they come up with another thing, no, go back. We already gave you the other things, you didn't understand it. Now we are delivering the other things that we fulfill what we explain and show in the technology apparatus. If you build and take these systems into Japan, many places where you have the radiation damage, or you're afraid of it, put it in this machine, walk into this machine, give it on about 10 minutes, even if you are exposed to radiation, you'll be de-exposed from the radiation. This is what's going to be used in space, and Japan is the best candidate for it because they really blown themselves up to pieces with their radiation. In so many ways, there's a beginning of a change. We use the water, we use the electricity, 
and we had the industrial revolution, now we have the plasmatic revolution, which takes us into a space. And the interesting part is, we told you 20 years ago, now we have to show it to you that it's here. Try to understand the principle behind the creation, then you unravel the mystery of my patterns and my books. Try to look at the human eye and knowledge of the present time, everything looks impossible and magic. It's not my problem if you believed in Father Christmas for past 200 years and use the earth materials and everything else and build for it. This technology is real, works in the space, and as I've seen very recently, Americans are running away from it very fast in their boats. It pushes peace, it pushes to show there is no need to kill, and as I said, we will install these machines in the prisons of today, that by most probably in the next three or five years, many prisons will be shut down. Keshe Foundation will make gifts to prisons around the world. Or you can do with the help to buy and give it to the prisons and let them come out. No addiction for life, no criminality. Secondly, why should we lock a man when we can free his soul? Elevate his soul to be free with him. That they can use that elevation of the emotion to put their life, their physical life, in a good use. It's, if I tell you what you can do with this technology, you lot will sell your homes, you sell your cars, to make sure these systems are everywhere, that man will not do the damage and the crime they have committed so much, so proudly. So said, my job is done. I've just got to show you a few more pieces, show you your flying machine, next April, in the beautiful city of Tehran, where I was born, and then my mission is over. Then you as a human race have to decide how and where, and the way you want to set the path for humanity in the space. The other question. Okay, um, don't see anyone with their hand up here, and our panelists are seem like they're. Short. Tongues, tongues are tied, as they say. Shocked. Yes. Uh, Rick. Uh -huh. um, they've asked me again to ask. The first generation is still connected. They must rem uh, be referring to the one used in Austria. But uh, as far as I have gathered, this has already been overtaken, hasn't it? We, we have said that we try to keep it because there's other things in, with this process that uh, the first generation is already running in China. And 
in a couple of places in Europe. So the first generation is already opened up. And uh, second generation, or what we call, what is coming up as a total a structure which is totally different, um, we will have, or what we call it, we try not to use any power, but we can produce enough power to run it. That should not be a problem. You see, none of you understood when I gave you the gift of the Magras. Any other question? There's something I have to tell you. Somewhere around about first weeks of January, Cash Plasma website in China will be opened up. What this means that all the knowledge seekers who produce materials or technologies will be allowed, will be be given access to sell their products worldwide, very much like the Alibaba Plasma and GANS technology. We own 51% of this company which is getting done, and the technical side should be completed, they tell us by the end of December, hopefully if they can do it. And we can all access to promote your products. And, uh, as I said, for one of the first things which you will see is like what already we sell on the Cash Foundation um, global system of what used to be like T-shirts and pads and that kind of thing, around about nine dollars or nine euro. And uh, all the, what we call the patches will be around about nine, to 19 euro. Uh, these are all CECCC certificated by the company in China. It will be part of the Cash Foundation operation. So we will not allow more than one or two items to be bought. So it means now he used to buy the paint pad from us, I don't know, 69, 59 something. You should be able to buy it on about nine to 19 euro, even cheaper in China. But the structure you will see, which will come up with the new website in China, I'll tell you now and then as we come to it further on, every time you shop, you will receive a coupon. You can take that coupon and go to other website like Alibaba and use it as purchase value. So, if you buy something like 50 euro, you'll be most probably given a 50 euro coupon that you can spend against positions, items which is put up in certain major websites, and it'll give you a chance to cross purchase across China and non-China. So will be the first time the two will merge. We operate what very much like the operation of the major corporations. So please, if you are producing materials or whatever, and you're selling a few here and there, start packaging it, start getting certification from your country if you can, or if you cannot get it certified, if it's different than what we do, we see if Foundation can help you to get it certified worldwide in different ways, if we see the appropriate. So, for example, as I said, the T-shirts and the pads will go definitely for 9.99 euro from beginning of the year, once the website opens up, the team has started already, the background of it has already been done by the team which has joined us, they've already done all the work, that's why we're coming out so fast. 
so you will see all these what we call we used to sell like a knee pads and everything else and the iPads all will go around about nine euro to nine ninety nine nineteen ninety nine. We we bring it so low that everybody can afford it and becomes item to be sold. We do not allow more than one purchase or two item purchase which doesn't allow people to buy and try to resell. We do not want to go into the resale uh, job through this because we have to produce so much material for this auxiliary there as part of the auxiliary use of this these machines. Some of these machines, when you use them for a specific cases, you need a specific materials like a t-shirt or a helmet or a hat or whatever. So we are not selling it to anything else. This is something we are producing for these systems as a package. Now it's surplus, which is well produced, huge amounts, and we can do this. It will be of the highest quality, will carry what we call CE Medical Certification 1 for all of them. But this time will be fully certified, which is medically certified through the appropriate companies in China and it will be delivered. And uh, as I said, we'll bring the traffic of the Keshe Foundation with major corporations that you can shop on this website and you can spend the coupons on other well-known websites or products which is offered equal one-to-one. -one. As I said, we are doing a lot of work in the background of the Chinese community, Cash Foundation is doing a horrendous amount of work, it's a lot of pressure on Wang Lin and the rest of the team which are there trying to get these things sorted out and we come back into a full operation of it by next few weeks and we we'll let you know as we develop more the books will go back on sale it'll be organized in the next few days as we saw in Italy it was never done uh, so you will get all those of you who placed books orders we found out a lot of stock which wasn't sent out by Italy and now is being sent out past few days. You receive backlog of the orders you were waiting for, and there is some uh, what we call refund understanding, which come from Italy and the past. We close all these hopefully before end of this month or early next month. That it means by we are closing the factory company in Italy. We do not, as usual, try and relinquish our responsibility, but we fulfill it. There's a lot of, um, what do you call it, people who would like to have the situation to be settled. Now we can settle it, we have more to do it, by closing Italy. And, uh, but we will open in Italy, in the industrial scale, very, very soon, as we have work to be done for decontamination. This is one of the reasons we start, we start for a full decontamination process in the, in the coming time, as we've done a lot of work for it, and we can more or less get it done ourselves. Any other question? Or, I think we have given you enough headache for today. There is one question from Ed in the Q&A who asks, uh, in the US for doctors to get involved, there's the issue of the FDA approval. So um, also many, many people in the US depend on health insurance to pay for medical procedures. Would you care to address these issues? We have no problem working with FDA. These are not medical systems, they are what we call environmental enhancement on the medical application it's in conjunction with FDA can test everything because there is no intrusion we don't uh, intrude, you don't need to drink anything, you can walk into the space is a change of environment 
and it doesn't take much for FDA to move. Uh, Americans who cannot do it in, in America, there are many, many islands and countries around you which will take the machine and it will be done. As I said, we have gifted one of the machines to the Austrian community and what I see, we have to start building reserves, one to every 10 or 20 orders we get for delivering in emergencies like what happened in Bahamas. We will use extensively for the Asia and Europe. As uh, you know, the Silk Road railway system, I was talking to our people in China today, it's very easy, within 18 days we can deliver anywhere in Europe, and it's safe, and we could, could be door to door to the city where you all buy delivery by train to the nearest train station. Uh, we will use the support of the Chinese structure heavily in the coming time. And uh, certification of it in each country, we try to sort out, this is part of the work I'm doing in the background, uh, by bringing the statistics, what is coming from team of doctors, from the trials, we are, the governments will use this as a basis that the first step is done. And it's been, makes it easier. We already have a FDA water certificate for in Ghana, we can transfer it or use it as a backup for FDA in US, because the Ghanaian FDA is based on the American FDA system. It's already interchanged. So, we don't see FDA as a problem, this is not a medicine, it's initially what we call environmental change. There's one additional question from Pia about uh, the patients who are on a medication treatment and if they're on a, a load of medication, do they have to step down on the medication before using the unit? The way the doctors are monitoring it and doing it in China is the, we allow the first couple of weeks the system works and uh, start reduction very, very small amounts. And then over a few weeks you see a total or majority reduction in medication. You don't really, you got to understand everything done is by supervision and the supervision of the medical people. Each center will have a number of doctors allocated to it, working from it, a number of uh, what we call uh, therapists, because you've got to realize, as you've seen in the video, these people most probably haven't done anything or could not do being paraplegic for years. And uh, what one thing you don't, uh, you might have realized is that um, you see gentlemen getting up and walking after a few days, you tell this to any physiotherapist, they'll laugh you off. I've shown this to a couple of physiotherapists, they said this is a very good actor. Because no one can do, no one can go so fast, because you understand the psychological body of the man through the brain of the man, we said, not through the physiotherapy. This movement we see is just because brain has opened it up, now they're just delivering what is now, has been closed, locked up or destroyed in so many ways, now opening up. And uh, um, we see this, I was talking to one of our colleagues, uh, in the sports center, in like football teams, for fast recovery of the players to go back. It can speed up by weeks and months, some of the processes. You can imagine, um, this is what I was explaining very recently, past few days to a number of groups we were talking to, 
Um, you know I've done a lot of work with ILS and MS. We see this as the ultimate solution for MS. On the koniec tłumaczenia. Dzisiaj trochę dłużej było, ale musieliśmy nadrobić trochę. Tak więc było bardzo dużo informacji. To, co przyszłość nam przyniesie i, i również z informacją, abyśmy wrócili do patentów. Nie wiem, ktoś chce coś dodać od siebie, to zapraszam serdecznie. Także słuchamy. Dzięki Jarku. Ja dzisiaj może nie będę streszczał, bo w zasadzie tutaj mamy kontynuację tego tematu i prezentacja tym razem kolejnych kroków, wyników, jakie są uzyskiwane dzięki tej jednostce balansującej. Myślę, że każdy gdzieś tam miał czas, żeby sobie na spokojnie to posłuchać, zobaczyć, rozeznać się w temacie, co się dzieje. To wideo, które było tam prezentowane kilkunastominutowe o tym urządzeniu i efekt takiego działania, ono jest też dostępne na naszym kanale, zostało dzisiaj wrzucone, także z napisami jest dostępne, jeśli ktoś chciałby się podzielić chociażby tym krótkim filmikiem, na który mam pokazany właśnie przypadek ochotnika, który tam korzystał dwa razy dziennie z, z tej jednostki balansującej, dwa razy po 30 minut w ciągu kilku tygodni odzyskuje sprawność, czyli obserwujemy to, czego medycyna obecna w zasadzie nie, nie widziała, nie zna, czyli odwracanie tego warunku nie tylko Alzheimera, nie tylko Parkinsona, ale obu tych schorzeń naraz i za tydzień będziemy też oglądać kolejną wersję tego wideo, gdzie ten, gdzie ten pan już będzie sam biegał, także postęp myślę jest niesamowity, jest, są ciekawe przypadki prezentowane i myślę, że będziemy widzieli też więcej, tak jak profesor wspominał o tym chłopcu tutaj, że z epilepsją, który 43 czy 40 ileś tabletek dziennie musi przyjmować i tam też wspomina o tych skutkach ubocznych w każdej z nich, w tej zasadzie jest to już taka równia, równia pochyła do tego, żeby przez całe życie być na różnych środkach w bardzo dużych ilościach licząc w całym czasie, gdzie wpływając też na ogólnosystemowo na organizm, na to, co, jakie skutki uboczne te medykamenty mogą mieć. Więc myślę, że no to zostaje nic innego, jak dzielić się wiedzą. Tak jak mówiłem, ten, ten filmik, samo wymaganie tego przypadku jest dostępny do zbalansowania Parkinsona i Alzheimera. Poza tym Także tym można się dzielić, a, a więcej informacji i więcej ciekawych rzeczy w kolejnych warsztatach będą, będą prezentowane. Także zapraszam na, na kolejne warsztaty poszukiwaczy wiedzy ze swojej strony. Dziękuję i dzięki Jarku za, 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 za dzisiejszy wieczór. Ja również dziękuję. Nie ma pytań na czacie, tak więc zakończymy dzisiaj i spotkamy się w czwartek, tak więc dobrej nocy życzę wszystkim. To były 305 warsztaty poszukiwaczy wiedzy w języku polskim z niedzieli 27 października 2019 roku. Tak więc do usłyszenia. Nadszedł czas zmiany. 
przejścia do prawdziwego działania Wszechświata. I nadszedł czas, aby zrozumieć, że używamy stanu materii, by osiągnąć poziom zrozumienia duszy człowieka. Teraz rozumiesz, być może, dlaczego Kreator wysłał swoich posłańców w imię tego, co miałeś. To oni przynoszą uszy, aby można było ich użyć, gdy nadejdzie czas Mesjasza. Mogę nauczyć duszę i przesłanie. Nie by się przeciwstawiać, ale poprzez ich zrozumienie przez tych, którzy stali się Mesjaszami, aby dawać ze swoich dusz, aby ich elewować. Zadanie stało się łatwe. Szkoła jest tutaj i uczniowie są tutaj w oddaniu. Wtedy nie będzie żadnej walki między tym, co nazywają muzułmanami a chrześcijanami. Baranek i lew będą jeść i spać w tym samym gnieździe. Chrześcijanie i muzułmanie będą spać i modlić się w meczecie, w tym samym kościele, w imię ich dusz, nie w imię religii, które są używane do tworzenia tak wielu konfliktów, dla korzyści tych, którzy byli hiperaktywnymi dziećmi. Nadszedł czas. Czas zmian jest tutaj. I jak powiedziałem, moje życzenie jest moim rozkazem. Jeśli pragniesz ujrzeć pokój, droga pokoju jest wyłożona bardzo wyraźnie. To dusza świadomości zbiorowej. Poprzez dawanie stworzy tą pozycję zmiany. Nic innego. W duszy człowieka nie ma długopisu. Jestem pewien, że po wejściu do społeczności uniwersalnej nigdy nie zobaczysz niczego zapisanego, ale równowagę pól duszy egzystencji. Staraj się być na tyle pokornym, aby nie stać się aroganckim w mocy, którą zrozumiałeś i posiadłeś. Inaczej wpadniesz w tą samą ścieżkę kościoła i meczetu. To jest to, co obiecaliśmy i to właśnie dostarczyliśmy. Musimy zrozumieć działanie duszy. I musimy zrozumieć, że dusza człowieka jest gwiazdą w kosmosie Wszechświata. Jeśli porównamy duszę człowieka i tak wielu nas, 7 miliardów w jednym zbiorze, Ziemia jest jak galaktyka, z tak wieloma gwiazdami. Kiedy patrzymy w głąb Wszechświata, widzimy galaktyki z setkami milionów gwiazd. Podobnie jest z planetą Ziemią. Niesie 7 miliardów pięknych gwiazd, które są duszą człowieka. Niesie z sobą duszę tak wielu trylionów zwierząt, roślin i wszystkiego innego. Jeśli więc patrzą ci, którzy nie widzą fizyczności Ziemi i jej zawartości, co widzą? Widzą galaktykę z wielką ilością pięknych, świecących świateł. Każda według swojej siły. Każda zgodnie ze swoją pozycją. Niemowlę ma piękną duszę, podobnie jak staruszek. Dla tych niefizycznych, którzy nie widzą fizycznego wymiaru tej planety, ale widzą siłę pola, jesteśmy gromadami gwiazd. Ludzka rasa, każda pojedyncza dusza, nikt z daleka nie widzi. To jest dusza rybaka, to jest dusza kosmologa, to jest dusza prezydenta. Wszystkie świecą bez względu na fizyczność. 
To jest magia. Oto co nowa nauka musi przynieść człowiekowi. Kiedy patrzymy przez naszą duszę, widzimy tylko gwiazdy w innych duszach. I to jest przełom. To jest zrozumienie. Na tym właśnie polegają te wszystkie nauki. Dojście do dojrzałości następnego poziomu, aby zrozumieć daleki kosmos. Wszechświat jest ostrygą dla tych dusz, które służą. Wtedy człowiek jest gotowy do wejścia w kosmos. Wtedy człowiek jest gotowy, aby stać się częścią uniwersalnej społeczności, która została obiecana. Nigdy nie obiecywałem wam nieba. Zawsze obiecywałem wam elewację człowieka, aby przyłączył się do rodziny. A teraz macie klucz. To wy musicie otworzyć drzwi, aby zrozumieć, że mogę elewować duszę tych ludzi lub milionów innych dusz, że fizyczne życie na tej planecie zmieni się. Wtedy jestem godny bycia częścią społeczności uniwersalnej, by być, aby służyć, aby się rozwijać, by być tam, aby być częścią, że w cyklu życia wszechświata staje się w byciu częścią, staje się częścią totalności. Kiedy człowiek osiągnie ten punkt, pojawi się nowy wymiar w sile duszy człowieka, który jest poza wyobrażeniem zrozumienia życia fizycznego. To jest brama do otwarcia nowego życia w nowym wymiarze, co jest poza wyobrażeniem tego, co mogliście nazwać nowym początkiem, nowym cyklem, gdzie ten cykl niesie ze sobą źródło stworzenia życia we Wszechświecie i Unikosie. To jest elewacja duszy, aby służyć. Stała się kluczem. Nie tron życia fizycznego. Czas jest odpowiedni, nadszedł czas, aby człowiek przeszedł przez ten proces.